hello viewers in this video we are going to see a data transfer a block of data is transferred also copied you can call example for 8085 microprocessor uh, let's understand this problem here a trans we have to transfer a block of data which is stored from 2500 h onwards the destination is 3500 h onwards the length of a block is stored in 24 ff h so this is a visual explanation 24 ff h location stores the length what is the length of block which we have to transfer from 2500 all data will go to 3500 so after we run the program we will have an output somewhat like this. This is the explanation with the sample data in a memory. So 24FF H contains 0, 5. That means we have to transfer 5 bytes starting 2500 onwards to destination location 3500 onwards. So after you run the program, you can see all data bytes are copied to the location starting 3500H. So this is the logical explanation in flowchart. We set the counter. Counter will be 5 in our case. We are going to pick this counter from the memory location. Starting addresses will be set for source and destination. Then we'll take a byte from source to accumulator from accumulator we copy to destination. After this action, we'll increase the addresses and we'll decrease the counter. When the counter is zero we'll stop this loop if the counter is not zero we'll repeat this action so once we pick the counter those many number of times the ex uh, action will be executed this is the flowchart the explanation with the program so first line that is lda is loading the accumulator with 24 ff address location value so that will be the counter that counter is then copied to register C then initializing the addresses in next lines that is LXI H and LXI D with 2500 and 3500 respectively then there is a loop action this loop action is doing what the flowchart is explaining to you it is copying a byte from a memory source to accumulator from accumulator it is copying to destination then incrementing the address and decrementing the counter if the counter is not zero then it will repeat the action so this is the flowchart merged with code code lines so in the first block we are initializing counters and addresses next block block number two we are copying the value from source to accumulator and from accumulator to destination then in block number three annex h and annex d are incrementing the source and destination addresses so that we move to the next address locations and decrement c is the counter which is decrementing after every action jnz is checking zero flag if zero flag is set then program will halt if it's not set then it will loop this is a visual explanation beginning of fifth first line lda 24 ff we see 0 5 is being copied to accumulator from the address location 24 ff next line is copying from accumulator to register c the value is 0, 05. LXI H is loading HL pair with 25 0, and 00. LXI D is loading 35 0, 0. Then 2500 H value is HL register pointing to. So your HL pair is holding 2500. So when we say move A comma M, that value 67 is being copied to accumulator. From accumulator, here this line stacks D is sending to 3500. Stacks D is taking address from DE pair that is 3500, and there it is copying the accumulator content. INXH increments HL pair, INXD increments DE pair, DCRC will decrement C register by 1. And here, since it has not resulted in 0, the decrement 0 flag is not set. And since 0 flag is not set, 
next line j and z loop will repeat this action so now after this it will go back to move a comma m where you are copying the value again from h l pair address that is 2501 it comes to accumulator from accumulator it goes to destination increment of hl pair increment d pair decrement c so uh, now it is 0 3 0 flag is still not set so this is basically looping action this loop will continue for three more times till c counter register c becomes 0 and when it becomes 0 0 flag will be set and it will look somewhat like this 0 flag will be set we have reached to the end of this loop and all five bytes are copied zero flag will be set now j and z will check zero flag it says that it is zero so it program will halt this is the end i hope you understood all the program if you have any suggestions please comment on this video thank you